The coronavirus patient taken from JBSA Lackland to Methodist Texan Hospital Tuesday remains in stable condition tonight. Now, if there are more confirmed cases in the future, it's not yet known if patients would be brought to the same hospital. Jesse de Goyado is live outside the hospital where the chief medical officer described the procedures and precautions that are being taken. Jesse. Well, that chief medical officer of the Methodist health care system says he has every confidence in those procedures and practices because he says they've been proven to work. Now, this is not a process that's defined by us as Methodist health care system. These are well established uh, processes around the country in the infectious disease world and specifically as specified by the Centers for Disease Control. Now, he says his staff already has trained and practiced what they need to do to protect themselves and to keep from exposing others. He showed the protective gear they must wear and remove under supervision whenever they enter or leave what's called a negative pressure room. It has its own exhaust system that takes air away from the rest of the hospital. Now, Dr. Hancock, who wouldn't go on camera to answer any questions, did use that show and tell to try to reassure those families and the rest of the public. We're live here along I-10 and 410. Jesse Degollado, KSAT 12 News.